Hey there, YouTube. Sinua here uh, with the Drone Cool YouTube channel. Uh, today we're coming from uh, Intersolar 2023, and I have with me Katie, who's going to share some details with me about uh, Solar for America. Yeah, absolutely. So. Solar for America is a solar module manufacturer located in Sacramento, California. Um, a little bit about our roots. Uh, our parent company was founded in 2006. They're called SPI and they're a project developer. So the name Solar for America was from a previous company known as Peterson Dean. When Peterson Dean went bankrupt, our company uh, bought the rights to use that brand name. And we are also located where the old CSUN California Synergy Factory was in Sacramento, California. So when they went bankrupt, we bought the assets and we bought their old production line and that's where we come from. So the name Solar for America obviously sounds very American. Yes. Obviously. Mm -hmm. um, tell me a little bit about, you know, the importance to your guys' company to have a factory in America because a lot of, most companies don't. Absolutely. So one thing that I love about our founders is that they believed in American manufacturing before the IRA guidance came out. So that definitely puts us at a competitive advantage right now because we started this process of investing uh, millions of dollars into new production lines way before the guidance was released. And so now we're ahead of the curve. Well, it's really, to, the way I interpret it yeah. is practicing what you uh, believe in, right? Exactly. What you're preaching. Yeah. Uh, and like I said, very few companies in the PV or in the solar industry are uh, making the efforts that I see here, yes. Solar for America making. Mm -hmm. um, can you tell me a little bit about, like, what is the common product in the lineup that uh, homeowners can be excited about? Yeah, so our most recent products, we just installed an M10 production line, uh, which is the latest in solar cell technology. So we're actually the only U.S. manufacturer that uses M10 cell technology. And that's going to make a residential 410 watt black on black module and a 550 commercial bifacial. Holy smokes. Yeah. That's quite a bit of a output from one panel. Yes. Um, yeah. And, it, and it, keeps, it keeps expanding. So we have already ordered our third production line that uses M12 cell technology. So with an M12, we're going to be making a 610 and a 670 watt utility scale module. Okay. Wow. I was about yeah. to say, for a residential application, that'd be uh, off the charts. Yes. Uh, but you're, you're mentioning a commercial application. Yes. Yeah. So residential and commercial. But the key for our residential is a 410 watt. Nice. But um, sorry, what's exciting is uh, we are also going to be using Topcon solar cells, uh, which are higher efficiency cells. And within the next two months, we're going to deploy those which increases our power class to 430 watts. So I don't mean to get too technical here. Yeah, you're fine. But uh, what is the, for all the analysts out there, uh, what is the uh, efficiency percentage that the 410 module will uh, output? So with the Topcon, it's going to be 22.3% efficiency. And you know, yeah. uh, that's nipping at the heels of what some people would consider, you know, premium sun power modules. You're there. Yes. Mm -hmm. You're there, probably at a lower cost, I imagine. Oh, definitely. Nice. Yeah. We never want to be the most premium price. We actually want to remain like a few cents below our top competitors. With an American-made product. Exactly. Yeah. Nice. So uh, homeowners that would get excited about this kind of uh, offering in the market, uh, how are they to find your product? Uh, so you can find our product through many of our distributors. Uh, we sell through CED Green Tech locations. Cranage, uh, Inception, ABC Supplies, and then from the end consumer, you know, just through your local installer. Yep. Um, are there um, any details about the warranties that you could share? Yes, so we have a 25-year product and performance warranty, which is definitely standard in American-made. Yep. Mm -hmm. It is. Yeah. Um, are there any other details that I didn't ask about that perhaps you know you care to share something that's exciting is uh, so as I mentioned we're always expanding and we announced that we're opening up a wafer manufacturing facility on the East Coast so we're gonna be even more independent from Asia and nice. be able to make the wafers here in-house in America very uh, very efficient yes yep. mm -hmm. uh, so allow me to ask um, you know you mentioned earlier uh, uh, some details about the, the history of solar for America yes um, are there, uh, for installers, excuse me, for homeowners that installed with the former Peterson Dean mm -hmm. company that is no longer around, 
Um, are there any um, um, efforts to uh, address customer service issues from those previous customers? We try as best as we can. Um, unfortunately, we didn't take over any of the contracts, mm. and so their warranties are no longer valid, which yep. is really unfortunate, but we do partner with Solar Optimum, which is a large installer in California, and whenever we have old Peterson Dean customers asking questions, seeing if they can get any upgrades, we send them over to them and they take good care of them. Excellent, so you have a, a partner that is rather large yes. to help uh, address any concerns yeah. or any issues. Yeah, alleviate some of the stress. Wonderful. Mm -hmm. Well, YouTube, you heard it here first, or maybe second, I don't know. It depends <laughs> on what you've been watching. But I really appreciate you watching, and if you guys like it, please uh, hit the subscribe button and show us some love. And thank you so much for your time, Katie. I really thank appreciate it. Thank you, guys. It. Yep, it was a pleasure.